When you see Roblox error code 267, it generally means you've been kicked from experience or banned temporarily from the game. Let's go through a couple ways to fix this and understand why it's happening. As you can see on screen, I put a couple images of what this error message could say. So your first step is going to be to read the message. If it says you were banned from the game or the server, the most obvious solution is to just wait out that ban. In some error messages like the one on screen, they actually let you know how long you're banned, but it's also important you understand why you were banned. Sometimes they'll tell you if they suspected you exploiting or cheating, and sometimes it'll just say that you're banned. Whatever it says, you need to reevaluate what you did in the game that caused this error to happen. If you exploit or cheat in any way, there's no other option than to uninstall your exploiting software and wait out the ban. Another way you can try to determine the cause of this error is to join another Roblox game. If the error still pops up, then it's most likely technical and not related to the specific game. The next step is to check your internet connection to make sure there's no issues there. If you are experiencing lag or a slow connection, then you can try rebooting your router. If that doesn't work, you should go ahead and try to run a speed test on speedtest.net or completely change your Wi-Fi networks altogether. If your internet connection is all good, then you may want to try checking out your browser add-ons. This means if you've recently installed a plugin of some kind, try removing it and joining the same Roblox game. If that fixes it, then you probably shouldn't use that plugin. However, if it doesn't, you can try that with other plugins that you may have enabled. Another solution is to try using a different browser altogether. Another reason this error pops up may be because of your antivirus software if you have any. On that software, you should enable game mode or try disabling it and joining the game and see if the issue still persists. This next step is for Windows users only and it's to ensure that Roblox is allowed through your Windows Defender firewall. How we do this is we basically go to our search bar and we search Windows Defender firewall. It's going to look like this and we could go ahead and click open. Once it opens up like this, we can look on the left and it says allow an app or feature through Windows Defender firewall. After we click on this, it's going to take us to a list of all the apps that we have allowed. It's in alphabetical order, so if you scroll all the way down to the R's, we can see Roblox Game Client is allowed on private and public networks. You don't have to allow it on public networks, but private is necessary. The final step is more of a workaround than anything. This just involves creating a completely new Roblox account to see if the issue still persists. This is definitely a last resort and it's not going to be ideal for everybody. And those are all the steps that I have. I do hope that your error was fixed and please remember the most surefire way to fix this error is to just wait out the ban. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and feel free to leave a comment below if this helped you out.